What is up guys, Mr. The Reverts here, welcome back to the channel. Today we are going to be talking about some more Call of Duty Modern Warfare information. Now specifically, this is pretty freaking awesome for some of you guys who may be hardcore fans of the Modern Warfare universe because yesterday during the release of the new Operation Apocalypse Z for Black Ops 4, on the store for the game, a new pre-order bonus for Modern Warfare went live when it was not supposed to. And that pre-order bonus contained one prestige token and Captain Price as a playable character for Call of Duty Blackout Battle Royale. Now, this is pretty freaking huge, guys, because this marks the first ever time in Call of Duty history where a character from a different universe crossed over into another Call of Duty games universe. Of course, there's not really anything much more to it than just an in-game skin, but still pretty cool to see a character cross over into a different Call of Duty games universe that are two separate entities. Of course, there's been heavy talks recently of rumors going around that Modern Warfare will contain a battle royale, and some are even speculating that because of this leak, it can open up doors to many more crossovers and changes to basically create this mega Call of Duty Battle Royale within Black Ops 4's Blackout. However, I truly don't think we're going to be getting anything more than just a character skin, guys. Even though I would love to see Blackout carry over onto the next Call of Duty game, adding more locations, characters, weapons, etc. from the Modern Warfare universe, I just don't see it happening. And again, this more than likely is nothing more than just a playable character. I'm going to throw a link down below to some footage of the PSN store and some images with the pre-order bonus below. And yeah, for you guys, again, this is not supposed to go live, and technically, it is a leak, so that's really why I'm not going to be posting it in the video. I don't want to risk getting a copyright strike. Um, but as for when this pre-order bonus is finally going to go live, I'd say sometime later this month, because it's rumored that a gameplay reveal for Modern Warfare is going to take place within a few weeks here in July. So what better way to celebrate that than giving fans a new pre-order bonus that contains Captain Price? Please tell me your thoughts about this pre-order bonus down below in the comments. Next up guys, I want to discuss a new rumor that surfaced regarding Modern Warfare 2 Remastered because of this image that was surfaced recently. As you guys can see, the title says Modern Warfare is back, but between Modern Warfare and is, there's the number 2 steamed into Captain Price's shirt. So just jumping straight into this guys, I'm pretty damn sure that this image is a fake and edited. However, I do think we are still going to be getting Modern Warfare 2's campaign remastered. I don't think multiplayer is going to be coming just the campaign specifically. But this image is just not an official promo from Activision or Infinity Ward. And even one of the developers for Infinity Ward thought this image was funny. Kind of shutting down this image. But again, still, I think we're getting Modern Warfare 2 remastered. It's just this image is more than likely a fake edited fan art. Um, I still think we're going to be getting some gameplay and uh, more information coming later this month regarding Modern Warfare and multiplayer, not just campaign, but multiplayer as well. All I can say is, guys, just do not take everything you hear, no matter who it's from, as truth. Things can get cut, new things can be added in, or even changed. So take everything you hear with a grain of salt. Of course, it's fun to speculate for sure, but just don't believe everything you hear. Of course, some of these rumors going around may have some truth to it. But to just say that, oh, because they came from this guy, the rumors must be true is completely closed minded. And if anybody tells you that you're an idiot for not believing them, hey, you're welcome to believe whatever you want. If the rumors do end up becoming true, good for you, whatever. But unless I get actual information from a developer or Activision themselves, I will still always, always take your word with a grain of salt compared to somebody who actually is a developer or working for the game studios. So I just wanted to leave you guys with that before I end the video for today. There's a lot of rumors going around about Modern Warfare. And like I said, just speculate, but take everything with a grain of salt. Do not believe everything you hear. Thanks so much for watching, guys. I love y'all so, so much. Let me know your thoughts down below in the comments. Till next time, I'll see you guys later.